Let's do a quick check on two organisms and their life cycles. First we are going to start with the butterfly. The butterfly has a four-stage life cycle. A butterfly starts its life as a small, round, oval or cylindrical egg. The egg shape depends on the type of butterfly. These eggs are usually found laid on the leaves of plants. The second stage is the larva stage. After the egg hatches, a larva or caterpillar comes out of it. During this stage, the larva mostly feeds and prepares for the next stage. The third stage is called pupa or chrysalis. Once the caterpillar is done growing and it has reached its full length and weight, the larva wraps itself into the pupa, which basically is a shield. On the last stage, the adult butterfly will emerge. The butterfly comes out from a compressed space and the wings won't be fully extended until it pumps blood into them. As soon as the butterfly comes out of the pupa, it will master how to fly in the next few hours. Once it knows how to do it, the butterfly will start the search for a mate and continue the reproduction process. Now we are going to check the life cycle of the grasshopper. The grasshopper has a three-stage life cycle. The first stage is the egg. The grasshopper places its eggs into a pods. These pods can contain up to 100 eggs inside. These pods are safely deposited inside the mud. During the second stage, when the eggs hatches, a small baby called nymph comes out of it. This nymph looks just like an adult grasshopper, however, it does not have wings. During the nymph stage, the grasshopper sheds its skin multiple times in order to grow and mature. Is during this process, that the grasshopper also get its wings. In the final stage, the grasshopper has become an adult grasshopper. The grasshopper develops long and powerful legs. After the grasshopper is fully mature, it searches for a partner to continue the life cycle. Thank you.